90% of people are not utilizing this window settings and this tool on their PCs for reducing the input delay in the Fortnite Chapter 4. Guys, you can use the settings on your PC for playing any game with the lowest input delay. So make sure to watch my this whole video and without wasting any time, let's dive straight into it. So guys, in the first settings, go for your window search and search for the keyboard and open up the keyboard settings. Now you need to go for the speed tab and here you need to increase the speed onto the short and the repeat rate onto the fast. Now hit apply and click OK. Once you're done, now in the next, you need to open up your device manager. For opening the device manager, right click on your Windows Start icon and go straight into the device manager. Once you open up the device manager, now here in the list, you need to find out keyboard and the mouse section. So here is my keyboard and the mouse and the other pointing devices. So click on this drop down and here you will find out multiple keyboards. So you need to go straight into the properties, go for the power management and uncheck this box which is the allow the computer to turn off this device to save the power. You need to apply the settings for all these options one by one, go into the properties, go for the power management and uncheck this box from here and then click OK. Once you're done with all of the settings for all the devices of your keyboard, now you need to go for the mouse and the other pointing devices. Click on this drop down, go for the properties of your mouse, go for the power management and uncheck the allow the computer to turn off this device to save the power. Click OK, go for the property again and go for the power management and do the same settings also in your device manager and click OK and close out the device manager. Before starting this video here is a quick reminder guys, if you want to improve your latency or your ping while you gaming with just one click, so guys make sure to download this application Gear Booster, link available down in the description, go there and download this tool on your PC. Now in the final and the last step, I'm going to show you a tool which you need to use on your PC. That is the ISLC Intelligent Standby List Cleaner. You can use it for clearing the cache of your RAM and also it helps you reducing the delay of your mouse and keyboard. Now I'm going to show you how you can properly use it. For downloading it, open up the link from description that will take you onto my website and there you will find out the same exact article with the same thumbnail of my YouTube video you are watching right now. So you need to open up that article and download this file on your PC. Once you download, now you need to double tap here and there you will find out intelligent standby list cleaner or the ISLC exe file. You need to right click here first of all, go for the properties, go for the compatibility and check mark onto the run this program as an administrator. Now hit apply and click OK. Now go for the intelligent standby list exe file, double tap here and here you will find out this kind of the interface. Now what you need to do, first of all here you will find out this purge and the standby list and you can check out here this my uh, cache of my RAM. You need to click on this option which is the uh, purge standby list and this will clean this cache. So also open up the task manager on your PC, go for the performance tab and go for the memory tab and here you can check it out here around 1.2 GB of the cache is utilizing on my PC. So go for the standby list and click on the purge list and here it will clean the cache of your RAM. Now once you're done, now go for the next step and first before using it make sure to stop this option from here and go for this option which is the list size is at least. You need to type here 1024 which is the default number and go for the next option which is the free RAM is lower than. So you need to change this value, how you can change it. So first of all you need to go for your this PC or the properties of your PC. So go for the system. And there you need to find out your installed RAM. So I have around 16 GB of the RAM installed on my PC. So now what you need to do, you need to now close out it, go for your Windows search, search for calculator and open up the calculator on your Windows. Now type here 16 and multiply with the 1024 and press enter and there you will find out this number. Once you find out this number, now you need to divide it with the 2 and click OK and there you will find out this kind of the number. Uh, so you need to go for your this box and type here 8. 192. Once you put it here, now go for the start, ISLC minimize and the auto monitoring. Jack mark on the box the options and now go for the time resolution. So here you find out maximum time resolution and the minimum time resolution. So go for this option and type here point zero five and now also check mark on the enable custom time resolution for the advanced user only. Go for the ISLC polling rate, click on the drop down, set it onto the 10,000 and hit apply and click OK. I simply minimize this tool and close out all this other application and the software will keep running in your background whenever you turn on your PC and help you reducing your input delay. Once you're done, here is an other and the extra step if you have the uh, software for your mouse so you need to go for your mouse and make sure to also set the 
a polling rate onto the highest available like i have the 1000 hertz so i'm using the 1000 hertz and guys that's it now close out it and now you need to one time restart your pc therefore all the changes will take effect then launch your favorite game and enjoy the best performance with the lowest possible delay of your mouse and keyboard i hope so you love it please make sure to drop a like on this video subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell notification to let the next video peace out